Hey, welcome to Let's Play Guitar. Today we are checking out how to play Imagination from by Shawn Mendes from his new album Handwritten. It's a very beautiful song, probably my favorite song of the album. And um, if you want to know how to play more songs from his album and some of his previous songs, then click here to go to the complete playlist for all of Shawn Mendes' songs. So let's see how to play this one. We don't need any capo or anything standard tuning and very easy chords. Um, we're just using one F chord, which is also an F major seven. So that makes it very easy. So this is very easy to play. We're gonna go through the right hand the strumming. All right, then let's start with the verse. It goes something like this. Oh, there she goes again. Same goes, same chord progression is for the pre chorus as well. So, what we're doing is we're using A minor, okay, first fret, first fret, and second fret on fourth and third strings. Then we're using F major 7, or you can use F7. This is the first fret on second string, second fret, and third fret. If you want, you can use the third fret on the fifth string and the fourth string. So you kind of like, like an F chord, but with the first string open, or like this. Okay, and then we are using C major. It's very easy to switch between F7 and C. And then we are using G major. So let's see how to play the strumming pattern. It goes like this. Okay, so it's kind of long. Now in this song, I mainly want to show you two strumming patterns. Okay, the first one is in this verse and the next one comes during the chorus. Now the chorus strumming pattern is easier than this one. So if you want to skip to the chorus and learn that strumming pattern, then you can use that for the whole song. But um, it would be interesting if you want, if you change the strumming pattern for the verse and the chorus, you know, to make the song better. So I'm, I'm just telling you if you want, uh, if you find this one difficult, then you can switch to the chorus strumming pattern, which is slightly easier than this one, okay? So anyways, for this one, what we're doing is down, 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 up, up, down, 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 Okay, it's kind of long. You got down, down, first. So first you have down, down, and then down, up, up, down, down. Okay, so down, up, up, down, down. So you get down, 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 up, up, down, down. And in the end, you want to do another down, up. Okay, now this down up is optional. You can leave it out if you want, but um, if you want to stay in, in the flow um, during the chord changes, you need to add this extra down up in the end as well. So down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up. And you move to your F major seven. Same thing, down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up. Move to C major, down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up, and then G chord. Down, 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 up, up, down, down, down. Now to make this song, make this strumming pattern more um, interesting, what you can do is the first down stroke can be on the bass note, okay, can be on the bass string. So just one single um, note you pick, for example, for A minor, you pick the A note, which is the bass note. Okay, this one or this one, fifth or fourth string. And then go ahead with the regular strumming pattern. So down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up. For F major seven, down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up, C. And G. You see? Or just go regular. So 
you do that till the chorus for the pre-chorus the same string pattern for the pre-chorus as well so Same again for the typical love. No. And then for the G chord, then during when when you're going to the chorus, you can just do down, 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 down. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Right? In my dreams, be with me. Okay, then the chords change for the chorus and the strumming pattern changes as well. So the chorus goes something like this. Here we are using an easier strumming pattern. In my dreams, Let's see how to play the strumming pattern now. The chords that we are changing are from C to G and then F major 7 or F7 then back to G and in the end we are doing F and E major that I will get to later. So you begin with down, down, up, down, up, down that's the strumming is pretty easy you go down down up down up down down and then you do down up during the transition so down down up down up down 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 up change to G down down up down up down 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 up F major 7 down down up down up down 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 up G again down down from there, who knows, maybe this will be the night of your kiss for the first time. And then during the end, again back to F major 7, after G we go to F major 7, not C. Or is that just me and my And then E major, strum just once. So down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up. And then E major, imagination, and then you go to the next verse. So in my dreams, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, G, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, F, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, G. Again, this whole thing. So it's F, C, G. Maybe this F seven, and then G again. Then F and seven again, down. to the next verse. Now like I said before you can use the same strumming pattern that we are doing in the chorus in the verse. So you can use A minor, F, C and G for the verse and the strumming pattern will be down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, F, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, C, G. And then when you are go to the chorus you can stay in the same strumming pattern my dreams, you know, and G, and F27 and G. Now after the second chorus comes the bridge, which is, I'm not sure if you can call that the bridge, it is just um, transition to the ending, and um, here the chords change a little. So the bridge comes after the second chorus, so I'll um, start with the very ending of the chorus, and from there, to the bridge and here you go a minor and f major 7 okay or f, f f major 7 or f7 and then you go back to your chorus chords okay and then the chorus again the strumming pattern is the same as our chorus so we're not going to go into that down down up down up down 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 up the same as our chorus strumming pattern so a minor f7 down down, down, and 
F again and then go to the regular C F major 7 these are the chorus parts G and then again the chorus in my dreams is ending okay and then you go to the end where is that just me and my imagination and then you go to this very ending of the song which is the same as our verse the difference is that now we are picking the strings individually Remember the chords for the verse are A minor to F, C to G. But the strings are picked individually. So A minor, I keep craving, craving you. F and then C. Say the words in G. Say to you. And then you strum in the end. So what we are doing is in the end, you are picking the fifth string, fourth string, third and second. I keep move to F major 7 or just F no need for the first string and then C and G any any four strings you just gotta pick four notes so okay and then in the end C so wanna say to you C chord strum down once to end the song Okay, so that is it for the song by Shawn Mendes. I hope you liked this lesson. If you did like it, then make sure to give this video a thumbs up. I really appreciate all of your support. Make sure to check out some of my other songs from Shawn Mendes. I'll leave the links in the description box below. Subscribe for more guitar lessons. And I will see you guys next time. Take care.